Welcome back Saints and Sinners fans and welcome to the recipe video. Now some of you may or may not know that I've already completed the game but you keep asking what's next. Well there's still loads of stuff to unlock. These things over here are quite simple. You're going to find these basically on the patrols that you see out and about. If you shoot them they'll drop extra stuff for you to find. Like I think one of these is a sticky bomb and you get something else in one of these. Just go kill loads of people, they'll drop stuff, pick it up. These ones, you've got to actually find yourself. Now this one here, I've already done a video on. I've done it on another save file, so it's not unlocked in this. So I'm gonna show you where the hidden safe room is, but if you wanna know how to get the key, because it's a little bit long-winded, I'll put a video up here. Just go and watch that, it will show you how to do that. But I'm gonna show you where the safe room is anyway. Now this one here, because I've already completed the game, I can't get back to uh, St. Vincent's. So, don't worry about that one, just complete the game. Once you complete the game, you will find one of these lying around, and this is what you would have found anyway in the house so really that just leaves us for these three to deal with now the mob boss is in via corral uh, the little house old town and the safe room is in memorial uh, lane so make sure i am well tooled up because i am not i repeat i am not in cinema mode for this because if you use cinema mode, you will not be able to save. Right, I haven't put anything there, so let me go and grab... Let me go and grab... I think I'll take that, and I will take Lucille. There we go. If you don't know what cinema mode is, it's basically like cheat mode for saints and sinners. Um, up there, if you want to watch the video on how to do that. Right, um... Let's go and do the mob boss daughters. The mob, sorry, the mob boss's neighbours were decent cooks. Let's go and find that one. So I'll see you over in Via Corral. Okay, welcome to Via Corral. Now I can already hear shooting, so we've got some patrols. There we go, there's some patrols. I wouldn't deal with them yet. So we want to go here, okay? So I would recommend going through the front door this side. So what are they? Let them deal with them. You haven't got to worry about them yet. Right, front door over there, go. Okay, here we are at the front door. It is absolutely surrounded by zombies. So, just gonna make a quick run for it. Hopefully no one sees us. Now this place is gonna be absolutely filled with zombies. I've got no doubt about that. So get your torch ready. And don't forget to pick stuff up on the way. Okay, we are heading for the kitchen. I can't quite remember where the kitchen is. There's a couple through here. Hey, you! <laughs> Come on. Oh. oh. Come on, why can't I get him? Get over there. Oh. 
There we go. So you deal with him. Okay, into the kitchen. Where's the kitchen? Where's the kitchen? There's the kitchen. Now the recipe should be just over there on the stove. Okay, nice and simple. I'll see you back at the bus. Right, so that is the Jambala. Let's see what it does. Uh, temporary makes all weapons more durable. Uh, and just for this one, it just temporarily increases stamina regeneration. Right, so the little house in Old Town. Let's go and find that one. I'll see you over in Old Town. All right, welcome to Old Town. This is where we want to ha uh, head to, this little red house here. So make your way over here, whichever way you spawned in. I'll, uh, I'll see you around here. Right, I'm in this location. We need to make our way around the front now, or we can go through here. Whichever you prefer. Right, we are heading for the kitchen. Come on, I can hear them. Where are they? Here he is. Come on. Oh. Right. Okay, here's the kitchen. It should be, I'm sure. How was that? In the fridge. All right, job done. I'll see you uh, back at the bus. Okay, so that is gumbo. What you get with gumbo? Temporary increases max health by 25%. Lovely stuff. Now, we've got to go and do this hidden safe room, like I said before. I've already got the key, which is right there. Uh, hidden room key, okay? Not I thought I'd drop that then. If you want to know where the key is, it's in the school. I think it's room 201. I've got a video on it. Go away, just go up there, follow that video, it'll show you. But I'm going to show you where the room is now anyway. All right, let's go to Memorial Lane. Right, if memory serves me right, we want to get to the Red House. And I believe there's a bookcase on the first floor, just as you walk in the door on the left-hand side. That's the secret room. So... Make your way over to this house, and I'll uh, I'll see you there. I'm probably going to cut through the garden, so I'm a bit of a way away. I'm just going to have some fun with him first. Ready? Donk. Give me that back. Right, I'll see you at the red house. Right, I am at the back of the red house, just in case you go around the front, but just make your way inside. I'm pretty sure it's on the first floor. Hey, buddy. I may be wrong, but let's go and have a look anyway. And there's some good stuff up here as well. Oh, like all these gold things. 
I actually think it's on the ground floor through this door. Yes, it's there. Let me just deal with these quickly. Come on. Where do you want it? In there? Right, there's the, the key slot right there. Okay, this is the clue on the back. Get it round, get my torch. Room 201, that's in the school, it's the band room. We'll take that anyway. We shall get the key. Put the key in. Right, so my problem is I've brought a load of uh, a load of guns with me. Right, there it is there. Compound bow. Where's my torch? What else have we got hiding behind here? Where did he come from? Oh well, it's not bothering me. Right, so this is the secret room. Loads of stuff in it, ammo-wise. So just help yourself. Anyway, I'm going to have a mooch around, because there's loads of stuff in this house, and I'll see you back at the bus. See you then, Bip. And there you have it. All the recipes are unlocked. Now, just so you know, I completed this game without needing any of these recipes. So, like, this one here, the one where you get in the St. Vincent's, if you really want to know exactly where it is, drop a comment below and I'll make a video on it. But apart from that, if you want to know any other things, like how to get... I think the favourite one is the Wolverine Claws. If you want to know how to get that, I can show you. If you want to know how to get the Esteem Mortal, I can show you as well. Everything you want to know, I can show you. It really is that simple. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please drop a like, comment below, and if you're new, just drop that sub button. Thank you very much. See you again soon. Bye.